morning, good afternoon, good night. This is Kai again. Welcome back to the channel. As the title you can see today, I'm gonna show you five shoes I wear the most. And I hope you enjoy it. And let's get started with the first one. First, we have this Balenciaga rope leather derbies. Unlike the Rhino or the square toe one, this um, rope derbies are a little bit underrated, I think. The ropes between the meso and the odd leather looks pretty cool, and the shape from the head to toe is 100% of my imagination of the derby shoes should be looking like. The only problem is the toe and the sole are pretty hard, so make it not so comfortable or um, I can say the most uncomfortable one in today's video. Um, I haven't wear any other Balenciaga shoes before, so I'm not sure if every of them are wear like this. So please let me know in the comment if you have any experience on Balenciaga shoes, um, especially the leather shoes. However, it's still a nice one and I will wear this on the day if I'm trying to be more hype or cool. Next we have this Joe Sander Lace Up Derbies. Nothing too special on this, but the craftsmanship by Joe is super impressive. The leather it uses is super soft. Once you wear it more, you will see um, the crinkle on the top. Let me show you. I mean, it's become perfect details by the owner himself, which is me. The shape is flatter than the Balenciaga one and it's more formal. Usually, I would wear this with flare or slimmer pants. But um, recently, I kind of like going with some white trousers. Next is the loafer by Kiko Kostadinov collaboration with Camper, which made in 2019. I got this on grill that I paid around $400 and it took a fucking long time for the shipping, which I thought I was get scammed by the seller. But finally, um, I got this after nine or ten months luckily thanks to all the mailman back to the shoes this is the most comfortable one in today's collection i won't feel any pain or sore after a whole day walking or standing the sole is super soft then will bounce back while i'm stepping on and it used the magic tape make it easy to wear and took off so usually it would be my first choice if I'm going to shopping which needs both um, long walks and take the shoes off often I would highly recommend if you find your right size just cop it and I can promise that you won't regret it
next one is the Hoka One One Tour Ultra High Boots. The only boots in my wardrobe currently. Um, Hoka One One might be the hottest shoes brand during 2019 to 2020 because they were using at the lookbooks or make a collaboration with some famous Japanese brand like Engineer Garments and Dub Tabs. I bought this about three years ago and I wear them a lot especially when it's raining and since they are made for hiking I really took them to mountain hiking once and make it super dirty though I can't regret it in my opinion it's still easy to fit with my current style since they are came out over five years list if you don't have too many budgets on the shoes Dr. Martins will be your best choice I mean they got various options like boots, loafers, sandals and today I'm gonna show you the most common one 1461 which is only took about 140 or even lower if it's on sale. I'm not gonna talk too much about the details because you can see tons of reviews or unboxing on the internet. You can say it's just a normal less up leather derbies, but it literally can fit with all kind of outfits. Might feel a little bit strange on mine because I just make the classic yellow line to the back. Because I might I like the old black shoes recently. Overall, it's a good pair of shoes. Um, like I just said, it's easy to fit, and I won't say comfortable, but definitely not uncomfortable. Because I won't feel any pain after um, I wear this on my feet. And yeah, I bought this over five years and I still wear this often so I will highly recommend everyone should have one pair of this. shoes that I wear basically every single day hope you like it and if the video is too short I'll put some shopping vlog at the end so hope you like it and have a good day or good night peace So we're in Acme Studio here. I'm trying on this baggy cargo pants, which can switch to shorts or so. It's really nice colorway here.
But the price are a little bit too high. So here's a size 46 here. The last one is 48. But the lens are a little bit too long. This will be fit on my shoes. On, but a little bit too short.